Hello, Sunshine, and welcome to the Network Journal's 25 Most Influential Black Women in Business 2016. My name is Dr. Stacey N. C. Grant, and I'm joined here today by one of our distinguished honorees, Miss Janine Uzel. I am so excited to be able to celebrate her, and I've told her I'm going to take this beautiful necklace that she's wearing. <laughs> Absolutely gorgeous, and we can see that you are gorgeous from the inside out because of your commitment and your work. So please share with our audience, what is it that you do on a daily basis? Great. Well, I work for General Electric. I've been there for 14 years now, and the past seven years of my career have just been explosive because I've really had an opportunity to do something that most people don't always get to do in their day-to-day, -day, and that is really serve my passion for the emerging market. So my skill set is in technology. I'm an engineer by training, and I have a uh, a focus on global business and I've spent the past seven years living in Africa and traveling to places like India and Bangladesh and Indonesia and learning more about the maternal and infant care market and how our healthcare technologies can serve in that space so I guess the short of it is that I'm supposed to make sure that women and babies um, stay alive so mothers that are pregnant up until the first 28 days of life and ensuring that when a woman in a rural uh, village in Masai Mara, Kenya, actually goes to have a baby, she can return home safely herself and with a baby. Because, you know, at the end of the day, what I've learned globally is that we as women, we want the same things. We want uh, healthy families. We want to have an opportunity to serve our communities, build our careers, educate our children, and live healthy and fulfilled lives. And I'm a part of that. So that's fantastic. How amazing is that? And GE allows you an opportunity with their commitment to these emerging markets. And what you shared is quite inspiring. And there might be a young girl watching who's thinking about what career, where do I go? How do I help? Even here in the United States, there are communities that still need that kind of attention and technology. What would you say to someone who would want an explosive career like yours? What should they do on their journey? Well, first of all, I encourage all girls to consider careers in STEM, and that's something science, technology, engineering, and math. And um, you'd be surprised. You may be in a tough spot where you're like, oh, I hate math. You, you probably just don't like doing your homework. But if you find that you have an affinity for technology, study a career in STEM. Go to your counselor or your teachers and say, you know, I'm interested in a career in STEM. There are so many programs that are out there now to help ensure that girls um, are advancing in this space. My degree is in mechanical engineering, and um, then I have an MBA in business. And so I've taken my passion for technology and tied it to the global market. And I think that what's important is that, um, you know, I'm an ordinary girl from a group of parents that sent me to college as a first generation with my siblings and have had an opportunity to, to travel and to live and to do some of the most amazing things through the company that I work for and the hard work that I've been willing to do. And I just know that um, I'm no different than anyone else. It's possible. And so if you're sitting and saying, can I do this? The answer is absolutely. And you just have to get um, the right village around you to encourage you to do that. Well, you can see why she's being honored today as one of our 25 most influential women in business because you're not just talking it, you're living it. And you heard it. Absolutely. You too can live a life if you put in the work and you do your due diligence with getting an education and surrounding yourself with the right people. The world truly can be your oyster. So thank you for your thank example you. of excellence. And we continue to salute you as you do the wonderful work across the globe, especially with our emerging markets. Congratulations, thank Ms. Uzel. You very much.